So, it's another show day, people, and I'm in Hamburg at the German Jumping and Dressage Derby. And the shuttle service at this particular horse show is driven by Mercedes-Benz, or provided by Mercedes-Benz. So I'm at the... Here's the reason for the shuttle service is most competitors come to the show in these larger trucks, or a smaller one like mine, and uh, the trucks are parked here at the show, and the grooms sleep in the trucks. That's, that's like a pop-out sleeping quarter there on that one. You pop it back in to do the traveling. Um, so the trucks stay here. The grooms live in the living quarters of the trucks. The, most of the competitors go to, to the hotel and then uh, one of the major German car companies provides a shuttle service, either Mercedes or Audi or uh, Porsche. As I said, Mercedes has provided the cars for this show. They've probably got a fleet of 12, maybe 15 cars going back and forth to the hotels all the time, picking up people at the airport, competitors that fly in, ship the horses up with the driver or the groom and fly in and Mercedes picks them up at the airport. So Klein Flottbeck is a um, city region of Hamburg. This is where the Derby Park is. It's a whole, no one there isn't a horse show here, that it's just a park that you can walk through and do things with. This is a map, a layout of it here. Okay, here is a very typical German tradition. Hi there, it's super. Darf ich ein kurzes Interview haben? Good morning, man. Good morning. How are you? Good. Okay, so this is very typical German here. Um, <laughs> here you can get a fish sandwich. And here in Hamburg, they, they actually feed the little kids. And they aren't even chained to a broom in the moment. These are a couple pony clubbers volunteering at the show. So this is Truck Corner. You can shop for trucks at this horse show. This one is on display from Bookman. This one actually looks quite interesting. I don't know who the maker is. But what, I think it's STX or something. This one's JK Horse Trucks. I think you might be able to get a discount on that color. Here's W. He's going to wear his tea green today. All right, dear Rita, this is going to be the first attempt at a walking video blog from the top of Vinyamaro. On a tour of the Hamburger Derby Park, um, and you're going to see lots of exciting stuff. It comes our way. We have to pass ponies and through bunches of people. And this, this trail that I'm on leads all the way through the Derby Park here in Hamburg. Hi, Ludger. Hi, how are you? Good. If we keep going through this little garden path here, a forest path, we come out to where the vet check was yesterday morning. And um, this is also kind of an extra warm-up lunging area, which I'm going to show you over here. This is a huge park, by the way. I think it's even bigger than <laughs> Hagen, where we were last weekend. I had to leave the, the dressage um, warm-up because there were so many horses on it that I really almost couldn't ride. So to cool my horse out, I brought him out here. It also gives the competitors who are warming up a bit of a break, one less horse to steer around. There's Danielle, who doesn't believe I can ride with one hand and videotape at the same time. She's, she's actually behind me when I took that shot. She's following me around in order to pick up the pieces should I drop the camera or fall off, which we're not gonna do. 
the uh, fire service is available should anything happen. I don't think we're allowed to walk through this part, so we're going to have to turn around, but this is the area next to the dressage arena. Oh, here comes the Coca-Cola truck. I guess we better go back the other way. So Daniela's going to take him back to the stable now because I'm at the edge of where I can ride. I'm going to give the rest of the tour on foot. Okay, this is the Hamburg Derby Jumping Park. They are between classes right now, building a course. It's actually quite a large stadium, as you can see here. Seating all around it. That's VIP seating on a restaurant back there. You can eat and watch the show. This is the very famous Hamburg bank, bank that the horses jump up and over and slide down. Try to get one of those in action later on. Whoever wins the derby here at Hamburg gets to drive this Mercedes. Championship from Hamburg, Mercedes-Benz. Check this out, Italian boot store. We're gonna have a hard, hard time going past this one. Look at this pair. Wow. <laughs> this is the Mercedes SLS AMG. Don't ask me about horsepower power and all that kind of stuff. I have no idea. All I know is that I would look really good in this car. Uh, what's your name? My name is Alexander Gostra. Okay. And uh, you're here at the Mercedes exhibit at the Derby Park show. That's right. Tell me something about this car. How much horsepower does it have? Uh, it has uh, 571 horsepower. Okay. And uh, it's the first car that AMG has developed by themselves. Okay. So it's, um, it's an absolute sports car. It has a wide uh, weight of uh, 1,620 kilograms, which is very light. Okay. For that sort of car. If well, you compare it with, with others. Because I'm a woman, I, I need to know how many different colors does it come in? It comes in uh, seven or eight different colors. Okay. Normal colors like black or silver. Okay. And some kind of little bit special colors like very nice brown. Or this red. Okay. Well, let me ask you this. Do you think I would look good in this car? I think so, yes. <laughs> you would. I think this is more my style if I could get it in a pretty red color. <laughs> Susie, can you say hi to my blog fans in America? Uh, hi, everybody. She just put in a blockbuster ride yesterday on her horse, Currency D. How are you today? Pretty good. Pretty good. We went for a nice dinner on the harbor last night. Yeah? Was it nice? Yeah, it was beautiful. And you're going to train now? or? Yeah. Okay. Probably not too, hopefully not too hard. Out there. I'm going to come watch. All right. Bye. Which television station is this? <laughs> NDR. NDR. Oh my god, it's not local. It's like national NDR. Okay. <laughs> They're filming my horse because he's so cute. He's begging. It's like everybody wants to film this horse. Look at that face. It's very entertaining. They're probably not used to being filmed while they're filming. <laughs> so I'm at the dressage warm-up now. Once again, to dispel any speculation about whether it's open to the public or not, it most certainly is. I'm just filming the roses because they're well. These are these are called Pfingst rose in, in German. Put, yeah, put one next to it. Exactly. These are on the tables here in the restaurant, where you can sit having a very nice meal and you can watch the horse show going on. 